what's up so today I have a haul for you guys and this is the haul that I asked you guys if you wanted me to record some of you guys said yes yeah, so I'm gonna do it so I bought a few uh, brushes from eBay uh, so I bought some rose gold a set of four rose gold uh, brushes go old school right here so um, they're kind of dirty because I am using them uh, but yeah they're just these four rose gold brushes and I'm in love these are so pretty like Hello, rose gold brushes. I will leave all the links down below if I can, if I find it. Um, but yeah, they're really, really soft. And yeah, I just, I pretty much use these two every day. I haven't really gotten into these other two. But I use this one for my eyebrows. This one right here. And then I use this one to apply my concealer and such. For the next set of brushes, uh, I was so excited. I was just you know, browsing through eBay and I was like... Every time I just go to eBay, I put cute stuff or cute, cute makeup or something like that. And this just happened to pop up. There are these brushes right here. Now, I didn't know these brushes are actually from like a company that like sells, you know, the ones with the actual brand name and all that. So I didn't know that. I bought these because they were pretty cute. And yeah, they have a rose gold barrel, white like hairs, and they have the unicorn like bottoms, two of them. They're white bottoms and uh, gold rose gold barrels and they're super cute they're just you know super cute uh, but yeah I haven't used these because they're too cute to use uh, but I have washed them they didn't shed or anything they're super super soft it's another brush I freaking love like buying brushes off of eBay I don't know why but I don't know why but anyways I found this brush off of eBay and these are like the famous I forget what they're called but I wanted to give them a try they're like they look kind of like toothbrushes or something but I bought the medium size small medium size I believe it was called or something. I don't remember what it was called so it's rose gold and it has a rubbery handle to it it is flexible like a little bit like you can move it and the bristles right here are so soft like super super soft like it is so soft I used this a couple of times I'm I can't really get used to like this under like to put concealer like blend out my concealer stuff it takes a little bit getting used to but I've only used it a couple times these next few items I bought off of Macy's and I bought these around Christmas time but I have realized that going on to Macy's or like dealers and stuff where they have like all the makeup brands like where Sephora has they have them like at cheaper prices than if you go to like Sephora or Ulta and yeah I bought some stuff off of there and I was really surprised that I could find like full size products on there and yeah so the first item I bought was this set of four I believe I already threw away the other packaging it came in but it's a set of four Tarte lipsticks I don't know what the lipsticks are called like like the, the, the collection and stuff but oh there it says um, Amazonian butter lipsticks so you get four, I got four full size lipsticks for around $19 or something like that. That is crazy insane, like, hello. Anyways, it like quickly sold out whenever I saw this. I wanted to go buy another one for like, for, some, for a friend, for a Christmas present, but I couldn't because it was sold out. Yeah, I'll just swatch these for you guys. So they come like this, they're super cute, like the packaging is adorable, seriously. So um, the color, this one is in Garnet. I'll swatch it they are like you know like lip butters uh, so yeah they're just a tint of color and they're really they're really moisturizing like seriously this one is in the color ruby and they smell so good they smell so good like they have a minty scent to it so you know this is gonna be real good for your lips the second one on there is ruby next one is Quartz. So the one on the bottom is Quartz. And this last one is Topaz. So this one is just a standard nude lipstick in Topaz. So the bottom one is Topaz. They're really, really pretty colors and they are super moisturizing. And yeah, if you can find these on Macy's or Dillard's or whatever, like other websites at a cheaper price, I mean, seriously, pick them up. Um, the next thing I bought off of uh, Macy's, I bought this set of MAC lipsticks. Um, I didn't get anything from this collection, but when I saw these and they were on sale for like 40% off or more, I think. I don't even know. I think it was 40% off, but yeah, it's the Nutcracker collection. And at first when I saw these, now nowhere in the description did it say these were mini. So my little brain didn't wrap it around like to read the description because these are mini lipsticks. It's like these are so tiny. 
super tiny lipsticks and they're super cute but the packaging overall is so cute but the thing I have a problem with is getting them out of the package like I cannot get them out of the package for like to save my life because they're like stuck on there so once you get them out of the package I mean it's a little the packaging is cute it's like a little drawer but it's a little hard to take them out of the packaging so these are the Nutcracker Sweet Red Lipstick Kit. They are all satins, and this one is called MAC Red. You know, it's just your standard red lipstick. Let me swatch them. I did take a picture and posted it on my Instagram. So this one is, uh, what you call it, MAC Red. This one is Rebel, and Rebel is just one of my favorite uh, purple lipsticks. And yeah, it looks like this. That purple one right below. This one is called Diva. So I pretty much own all of these lipsticks um, in the full full size version. So the bottom one is a Diva. And these are just some of my favorite lipsticks in little mini forms. I just noticed that. And this last one is called Lady Danger. Oh, this is the orange one. Oh, I've always wanted to try this one. I just noticed it. Okay, so this one is called Lady Danger, and it's like it's one of the orange... Whoa, it looks super bright on there. But it's the orange-reddish lipstick. That probably won't look good on me now that I see it. It's like really bright. Maybe in the summer. I don't know. It looks kind of like a highlighter on there. Whoa, dang. So another makeup product I bought was... Okay, so I bought this because of the packaging and I kind of was, you know, I need that in my life. This wasn't cheap at all. Like seriously, this wasn't cheap at all. It is the Hourglass Palette in Ambient. Uh, yeah, I mean seriously, why did I buy it? I mean, hello, marble print. Yes. Okay, so it looks like this on the inside. It's very pretty and all that jazz. Uh, but yeah, I've only used it once, maybe twice. I bought this palette on a whim and it was just a birthday present, a Christmas present, a overall, you know, I need to get myself a present, uh, to spoil myself, to treat myself kind of present because this is $80. If you didn't know, this is $80. And this is the most expensive piece I own. This is, you know, the most expensive piece I own in my collection. And I don't want to use it. I've only used it maybe once or twice and that's it. It's not a thing I go I like, you know, reach for on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, but yeah, I got it. It's mine. Let's move on. The last makeup uh, products I have in my collection to show you guys is the MAC Selena collection because I was on the website the day it came out and Macy's and MAC really played me. And yeah, if you were on the website like the first day it came out, you know, you feel my pain. Like, I had everything I wanted in my cart, and then I went to check out, and boom, it was gone. Yeah, so I only got, the first time around, I only got to get uh, the Tecno Cumbia, uh, the powder. You pretty much, you guys have pretty much already seen this product already. Seriously, if you haven't seen what this looks like, I mean, where, you've, where have you been? Uh, but yeah, it's just the, you know, powder blush, uh, duo thingy I, I now own two because I didn't want to use my the first one I got so I got another one and yeah that's just how I am so I got this one that has her signature on it if you've never seen it in your life I mean seriously where have you been so yeah it just looks like this has an indentation uh, print thingy of her name uh, for signature and I had to get two the first time around I got one and I got one the second time around it came out um so yeah now own two I can actually use one so yeah I'm more prohibido and it is this like nude color now I'm not too thrilled on this lipstick like seriously it does not show up on my lips at all if it does it just it's like my lip color but with a little sheen to it it's not like a lipstick I would go to every day like I like a little pop of color a little you know you know to give me some oomph to my face so this one would just probably just sit in my collection but yeah overall I really love the Selena collection so I didn't get everything but I did get the things that I wanted so I wanted all three lipsticks and the second time around that it came out I got another blush duo and the last two lipsticks that 
I want it from the collection. Dreaming in a View is actually one of my favorite songs from Selena. And yeah, so yeah, it looks like this. And people have been saying that this looks like, I uh, believe, Rebel from Max. So if you don't own or if you didn't get a chance to get something from the Selena collection, I mean, but people just want it for the packaging. Seriously, it's super cute. It's purple. It has her signature on it. Um, but yeah, the last one I got was Como La Flor. And this one is her signature red lipstick. Seriously. So it looks like this, the red lipstick. And I am dying. Got all three uh, lipsticks that I wanted. And yeah, I'm a happy camper. But yeah, that's pretty much my makeup haul, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And hit the little bell thingy that now YouTube has. So you can get notified whenever I post a new video. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Yeah. Bye, guys. Oh, <laughs>